Hello, my crafty friends. Welcome to my channel, and thank you for tuning in. You guys, I am working on some Christmas cards. I know it is at the end of this year of 2022, and I know you guys are working on uh, crafting, trying to get these Christmas cards out to your family and friends. Well, that's what I am doing. I'm doing the same thing. I am trying to create some cards for my co-workers. Um, I'm trying to um, get it all set up, getting my goodie bags together so I will be able to bring in, um, my goodie bags in on my next day uh, to work on our following, well, actually, you know, the last week of our work day. Um, before I shut down before Christmas. So, yes, you guys, I wanted to do a car share and share with you what I had created before I, you know, send it out or not actually send it out, but, you know, get these, um, Christmas cards that I had handmade for my, um, co-workers. So, but, but before I get into that, you guys, let me go ahead and welcome you guys for coming back to my channel, um, supporting me and riding this journey along with me and for those who coming over to my channel for the first time um thank you for coming over hopefully you will continue to um see what i am up to in my craft room and um looking forward for you guys to continue to ride this journey along with me so yes you guys i am excited um uh, what i had created and um you know if you've been following me, you know, my co-worker loved what I be creating. And they had, you know, mentioned before, you know, asking me why I don't sell my cars. You know, actually, to be on the real tip, you know, I don't have time. I just, you know, I don't really focus on making cars. You know, I like to do other things. But, you know... I know one of my co-workers, she did uh, ask me to make some cards for her, you know, so she could send it out to her family and friends. And that is one of the items I am going to make for her for a Christmas gift. So I'm going to uh, make up some Christmas cards for her so she could have for her stash. So let me go ahead and share with you what I created. And now, I didn't... um. I did put up the items that I use to create these cards. I do apologize for that. But hopefully you could catch on what I did use. So let me go ahead and share with the cards that I did create. It. So I made two of these cards. So I had um, picked up this stamp uh, from this year. Um, for Michaels, they have this stamp out. Um, uh, I am I had embossed on uh, the stamp with this um, recollection um, tinsel embossing powder. You guys, you know I really, really, really don't like using glitter. <laughs> it is so messy, but I did use this on this card, um, and uh, the stamp. I used, let me see if I can find the stamp real quick. Because I have put majority of everything up, you guys. Uh, this stamp I picked up this year. This is what I had purchased. I don't know if you have watched the haul. But this is what I had used on this card. And this is what um, my outcome and it said home for the holidays. And the paper I used was this paper collection I had picked up from Tonic Studio. So uh, I used some white cardstock. If you can see the backing of uh, Michael's Recollection Gold Foil. And the paper in the back that is from Tonic Studio. And then I went ahead. I used... Oh my God, I can't remember what um, dye I used for this. 
but I had used some recollection on uh, stamped I had in my stash forever. The sentiment it say may your Christmas be cozy, warm, and bright. I had that in my stash forever, and uh, I can't remember what dye I used for this cutout for the stitch dye. <sighs> I can't remember. But this paper in the background, this is by uh, uh, Tonic Studio also. But yes, this is how this card turned out. And I hope the ladies that I, um, I'm going to give this to, I hope they like it. So I made two cards of that. Then I can't remember this paper collection. I just purchased this paper collection. So I made this card. And I know for a fact this die set is from Diamond Press. I got it from HSN. It says, Tis the Season. Uh, let me see if I can um, find this paper collection. I believe it's right behind me. Um, let me see. The paper collection I got is by Simple Stories, Holly Jolly. So I use that. I use the ephemera. So I that's what I had used that collection. And I use some twine. Let me see if I can find the twine I use. I believe I use some of this twine. And I use the ephemera from that collection. And I can't remember what stamp set I got this sentiment from. I do apologize. But this is the sentiment I use is wishing you a season of gladness, a season of cheer, and to top it all off a wonderful year. Now I just put that back. Let me see. Let me see you guys. Gotta work with me, you guys. Please work with me. Uh and I think these was all in my stash. I had these in my stash forever. And I believe these are all from Michaels from Recollection. And yes, it is. So the sentiment is from Recollection. And I use this sentiment. Okay? So use that. Here's my next card. From the same paper collection. Use the... Um, the Ephemera, ephemera from that collection. I just thought that was so stinky cute. Use that gold foil. I can't remember what dye I used for that. But I used the ephemera from the collection, fa la la. And I used the, the washi tape from the collection. And then the inside, I think I used the same sentiment, if I'm not mistaken. Nope, I used, uh, it said Merry Christmas. And I believe I got that from my stash. And also from uh, Michael's recollection. And I used, I love the font. I used Merry Christmas right here. And then I used Christmas. Well, I used Merry and then I used Christmas. And this been in my uh, sash forever. Okay. So those were two cards I uh, made. Then. Oh my gosh. Uh, let me see if I can find. Everybody have this die set. It buys cell binders. Let me see if I can find it. La la la. And. I used this die set by uh, Spellbinders and then I used the stamp set to go with it and the stamp set I believe I used was no let me see um Sending, which one I use? Let me, um, I use Sending a Little Holiday Sparkle. 
that's the sentiment I use off of this stamp set that goes with this die set. Okay? So let me show you the card. I just thought that was so stinky cute, you guys. So stinky cute. And I can't um, remember the paper collection, but the paper I used was in my stash forever. It came out so cute. Time consuming, but I believe it turned out cute. And the sentiment I use on the inside is say, have yourself a merry little Christmas. I believe, let me see. Let me see if I can find that sentiment. Um, what is that? Have yourself. Do -do 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 -do. And that's another sentiment that was in my stash. Um, by recollection, I used that sentiment. Been in my stash forever. So I use it for that card. And I, and I made two of those. And if you notice, I made one that was white and then the one that was red. And I think I used both of the sentiment. Yep. And then if you look at the background of the paper, I used this paper. I can't remember the paper collection, but then I used... The background of this, I use a letterpress um, uh, folder for this. And I'll, let me see. And it was by Stampin' Up. Let me see if I can find it. And it been in my stash forever. And I had never used it. And I finally use it. And it's by Stampin' Up. It's called Fancy Fan. So I finally use it through my... um. Um, Sizzit, um, Big Shot s Switch. So I'm excited that I was able to use it. So I love how the cards turned out. And then, the last two cards I made. I just thought this was so stinky cute. I love, 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 love it. And you guys, I know, you guys know which stamp set I use. And I'm going to share that with you. Let me find the stamp set. I got it right here. It's somewhere. Wait, give me a second. And it's by um, Expression uh, Creation by Sam Pole. Pool. Love the stamp. Nice size, you guys. So I finally used that. And of, of course, if you was. Um, been following me you know I did a big haul on uh, all this person um uh, collection and I just love how I color it up and if you see I use some of the let me show you I use some of this uh spec spectral nor uh, sparkle the glitter of the mitten I hope you can see it. And I use my, um, to color it up, I use some of my, um, I pull out my, uh, Shyamalan, Shyamalan, I don't know if I'm saying it right, Shyamalan or Shyamalan, but I use this. I use different colors. I should have kept it out and I could have told you what color I use. And then I had used my Ma Podge Dimensional um, Magic. I love this better than um, my Glossy Accent. But I like this better. My opinion. So, look all that glittery. I just think it turned out so pretty. And the paper I used, what paper did I use? 
Let me see if I can find the paper collection. Are you give me a second, you guys? And this is really in my stash, you guys. And I picked this up, oh my God, way back when, at Tuesday morning. I used this paper collection, picked it up, and this was back in 2018, you guys. So I used that paper collection. And then the sentiment I use uh, it, from the stamp from the um, stamp set it say warm winter wishes came from the stamp set so I use the warm winter wishes so you guys that is my cars that I had made for my co-workers I'm very excited how everything turned out. I hope they love everything I made for them. Most likely they do. But I really do. Uh, it was time consuming. But um, I need to get more into it so I can pick up my pace of making cars and, you know, getting it out. You know what I'm saying? But um, I like them. I really, really do. Um... But, um, yeah, I'm excited. I just got to put their bags together for them. So when I return back to work Monday, you know, we do our little exchange, um, our Christmas gift exchange. So, yes, I'm, I'm excited. I'm so excited. And, you guys, if I don't come back uh, before Christmas, um, I would like to wish each and every one of you guys uh happy um or oh, well merry christmas and i would like to wish you guys a happy new year's hopefully i do come back before new year's but if i don't yes happy new year's you guys and you know i want y'all all please please be safe you know so if this is your first time coming over to my channel and you have not subscribed and you want to see what Lisa is up to in her craft room, please hit that subscribe button. And when you want to see when I upload a new video and you want to be notified, please hit that bell. So with that being said, get to crafting and you all have a blessed day. Bye-bye.